Hey guys, what's poppin'? It's me, a 21 year old weeb sitting behind his desk in the darkness that is going to help you today on changing your language in League. Yes, today we're changing our language to Korean. The reason why I'm doing this video again is because I've made a video like this longer ago when the new clan got released and the video got so old people would comment something like this. Anyways, you sit back, relax and enjoy. Alrighty, before we get on to that stop, I'm going to give you guys a little disclaimer and then at the end of the video, I'll go through most asked questions when it comes to changing your language in League. It is all pretty simple, no worries. So what I wanted to say is that this will change your whole client's language. Yes, including voices, texts, item names, rune names, announcer voices, everything. It is basically going to look like you're playing on a Korean server. And one little buggy thing you're going to have to deal with is that people reported ever since Valorant got released that their language got changed in Valorant as well and this is probably happening because the Riot's new client is all in one right now so pretty much if you change your language in League it is going to change in Valorant as well. If you're okay with that then let's go ahead and do this. Alrighty so here we are on my desktop. First things first what I'm going to do is open my League of Legends just to show you guys how my client looks like right now and to sign out because there needs to be some downloads to be done so go ahead and launch your lead client and as you guys can see here everything is in english um everything works just fine i can go into the collection every champion name is just normal whatever uh what we need to do right now is sign out so you're gonna click on the little x on the top right and click on sign out all right there we are uh, we're just gonna close it right now next step is to find your league of legends directory there are two ways you can do that one is by right clicking your league of legends icon if it's on your desktop clicking on properties and open file location and this will open the location where league of legends is installed except it will open riot client and that's not where you want to be you want to click on riot games and league of legends and this is the proper location now if you cannot find like that if you don't have league of legends uh, icon in your desktop what you want to do is open file explorer you're going to go to my computer uh, local disk where your league is installed mine is in c and it's usually going to be in c you're gonna see this folder called riot games you're gonna click there make sure to click on league of legends not riot client once again click on league of legends scroll down until you see a league client you're gonna right click on it create shortcut we're gonna put this shortcut on an accessible place usually desktop would be the one now this is a very important step what you gotta do is right click here click on properties and this will open this is a shortcut from where we will launch our league of legends once so the settings apply we're going to go for korean language we're going to do a little space bar in the target box two lines very important type in locale equals ko underscore capital kr I'm going to be posting this code, so do not worry. All the way to the right, one space bar, two lines, locale equals KO underscore KR capital. I'm going to post that, so do not worry. In the description, you can find it right there. Uh, you want to click on lead client. And as you guys can see, this will be in the Korean already. What you want to do is log in. Here goes your username, here goes your password. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, so this is the usual start of every Korean client. That's normal, do not worry about it. And as you guys can see, everything is pretty much in Korean. Now, at first you'll get to download Korean files, which is completely normal. The client needs to download the voice packs, the tags, the font, pretty much everything. So you're gonna have to wait for it to download. Um, This is just TFT, I'm gonna close that. I'm gonna go ahead and wait for it to download and pretty much close out this video by being in a practice tool game and showing you guys that it actually works. Okay, so the updating is done. I'm going to click on play right here. Uh, How do I load up practice tool again? I forgot. It's probably this as far as I remember. Okay, that's not it. Or maybe it is. I think it is. What did I just load? <laughs> oh, well, whatever it is, we're just going to go ahead and load that up. So here we are, as you guys can see, 
everything is in Korean. Um, my in-game sound is disabled, so you cannot hear the Korean voices, but it is what it is. You get even the font, you, the system messages are going to be in Korean. As I said in the beginning, it's a full-on Korean voice pack. It's like you're playing on a Korean server. And that was pretty much it. I hope I didn't waste too much of your time. Talking about time, all I have to say is that don't waste your time, man. Start making every day count by basically leveling up every single day, improving and like coming out as a better version and going to bed satisfied, which is honestly the best feeling in the world. So once again, keep the grind up and most importantly, again, don't waste your time. Too many thoughts on my mind, I can't sleep at night, so I just keep writing. I don't need no help, I don't need opinions, so don't waste my time then. I just been living online, my city don't show me no love and that's fine. Local radio stations, I got more plays than all of these rappers combined. I'm going, I'm going again, I've been going in, I'm fed up with so many things.